The BAFTA Award nominations were announced early Tuesday morning in the UK, with three billboards outside Ebbing, Missouri earning nine nominations across many of the major categories, including film, actor, director, and both supporting shortlists. Joe Wright's Darkest Hour also racked up nine noms, but thanks to the technical categories, it was The Shape of Water that led the field with 12 nods, including film, director, actress, and supporting actress. Let's take a look at the top contenders and surprise snubs in some of the major categories for the BAFTAs, which will take place on February 18th. Joining The Shape of Water and three billboards in the best film category are Call Me By Your Name, Darkest Hour, and Dunkirk. Hoping to walk away with the award for Best Director will be Denis Veneur for Blade Runner 2049, Luca Guadagnino for Call Me By Your Name, Christopher Nolan for Dunkirk, Guillermo del Toro for The Shape of Water, and Martin McDonough for Three Billboards. The talented ladies in the Best Actress category are Annette Bening for Film Stars Don't Die in Liverpool, Frances McDormand for Three Billboards, Margot Robbie for I, Tonya, Sally Hawkins for The Shape of Water, and Saoirse Ronan for Lady Bird. In the Best Actor category, we have Daniel Day-Lewis in Phantom Thread, Daniel Kaluuya in Get Out, Gary Oldman in Darkest Hour, Jamie Bell in Film Stars Don't Die in Liverpool, and Timothy Chalamet in Call Me By Your Name. While there are kudos for the biggest and buzziest American films this season, British titles or British co-productions dominated the list. This Brit focus may explain the most glaring snubs from this year's nominations. For example, Steven Spielberg's The Post, which is a leading Oscar candidate, picked up zero mentions. Instead, BAFTA voters opted for more homegrown history in the form of World War II dramas Darkest Hour and Dunkirk. Another glaring snub was Dee Reese's sweeping period drama Mudbound, which also came away empty-handed. The fact that Mudbound was a Netflix title may have hurt it with more traditional BAFTA voters. Three other awards favorites, all with US-centric storylines, were passed over by BAFTA in the best film and director categories, but they got recognition elsewhere. They are Jordan Peele's Get Out, Greta Gerwig's Lady Bird, and Craig Gillespie's I, Tonya. Another surprise for many was the Best Director nomination for Denis Veneuve, who helmed Blade Runner 2049. The Canadian director got raised for his reboot of Ridley Scott's sci-fi classic, but it's rare for a genre title and a sequel to get that sort of BAFTA love. Blade Runner 2049 picked up seven more nominations in technical categories, meaning its BAFTA total matches the eight given Scott's 1982 original. To read the full list of nominees for the 2018 BAFTAs and more on the snubs and surprises, as well as reactions from the nominees themselves, you can head to THR.com. For The Hollywood Reporter News, I'm Lindsay Rodriguez.